It is freaking hot today. Got a, I think that's a power line coming very close to my van. I gotta get up there right now. Got a AC down. And let's get to it. That ground is super uneven. All right, so they got two carriers here. The one that has issues is the one in the front. Uh, I think it's running. Yeah. So we'll see. I think the filters look decent. Okay, yeah, it's gonna be this one here. Alright, so coming out of the vents, we got about 65 degrees. It's not too bad. So I think it's just like maintenance. Uh, we're going to clean up. I'm going to take a look at the coils, probably clean them, check pressures, all that good stuff. And man, it's hot today. Uh, they do have a big window that goes across the front and it's about 100 degrees uh, on the window. So that doesn't help either. I didn't check if they have curtains or anything because usually when it gets hot, they usually put some kind of screen there at least most of these locations. So we got the sun hat going on today. And I usually use a cooling rag. Uh, you wet it and uh, keeps you fresh. It's it's really hot, it's like 100 out here. And uh, our no cool season is starting up again. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, and then I saw the other one had a drain issue, so I'm gonna clear that out. But yeah, uh, when it's hot, stay safe, stay cool. Uh, let's get back on the roof. So this is what I'll need, my hose and some coil cleaner. Really like these uh, Venom packs, super cool. I won't need this because they do have water supply. More than likely just a maintenance call type of deal because nobody gets maintenance right now. All right, so we got a water supply here so I can use my hose I did tie this and clip it onto the bucket because I'm gonna pull the bucket up with a rope put some of this in here make sure it was untangled so I don't have to like go up down up down just to get water I can just hook up turn it on already and be up there and I like being covered head to toe when it's this hot outside so I use uh, sleeves arm sleeves they're breathable but they keep me from getting sunburn and stuff and the sun hat and the uh, cooling towel I use. I like to stay safe out there. Yeah, so as it fell out, uh, that worked and not a little loss of hose. So I'm gonna open these up real quick, check pressures, and then we'll, we'll wash them probably. I'm pretty sure they're dirty. million screws later uh, I got this out it is a double row so I'm gonna check in there gonna run it with some water real quick uh, I gotta work kind of quick because they I got to this in the afternoon so it's pretty hot I don't want to have it off for too long first I'm just gonna use some water I want to see how dirty it is first Okay, yeah, <laughs> it's actually worse than I thought. It didn't look horrible when I looked at it. So I'll run it with water real quick. And then we'll use the cleaner. And uh, I'll spray down in between the rows also. And while I'm here, I'll probably do the other one over there too. And uh, just lack of maintenance, you know how the year's been.
So like I said, I'm in a hurry. I don't want to pop the whole top off right now. So I'm going to lift it up. And it's not horrible, but I do want to get cleaner in there and then rinse it out. So I'm just going to point my gun in there and uh, see what I can do about that. Uh, I'm sure just washing the outside would make a big difference, but I'm going to try and get all of it. let it drip out a little bit probably hit it one more time and then I got to hit it from the inside out real quick and then down the, the split too Coming out from the split row, this is more dirty than I thought. Still got black coming out. Already. So I'm going to try and show you guys the inside. our back AC I uh, noticed that this thing was dripping we got oh yeah it's full uh, we got a fog drain on this one I cleared it out I'm gonna clean this one too even though they weren't complaining about this one just because I'm already here and I'm gonna let that one dry for a few minutes before I turn it back on and put it together uh, while I'm waiting for that I'll get started on this one I really got to go pick up a blower so I can blow out or dry these out myself uh, this is not a micro channel so I don't have to worry about that today but our uh, no cool calls are going to be coming in quick already so got to be prepared All right, so I'm sure I got it on film that I dropped my, or I tossed it and um, forgot that there's a piece that's plastic that just popped off or uh, snapped. 
and I don't have another hose on me. There's actually a Walmart down the street that I'm gonna go after my call and pick up another one. Uh, in the meantime, I'm gonna go cordless. Use that for the second one. Uh, all I have to do is fill up the bucket like halfway and it should be enough water. Take it to the roof. And uh, I should probably have like a heavy hose as a backup, but I just, I really don't like those, uh, the weight of those. Okay, we got this set up now. And uh, I'm gonna wet it first real quick. Obviously this uh, setup is not ideal, but I have it for situations like this. And I can't use my hose. And at the end, I just switch it to this one, which is more of a regular spray instead of a pressure washer setting. But it does use more water, so I only use it at the end. See, this one's a micro channel. So I'm not gonna clean it because I now have to air it out. Because uh, if you have water in a micro channel and it runs, you can get a high head on it because the water gets trapped in there. So I'm not even gonna mess with that. Uh, if they want a PM, I'll come back. And I'm not gonna worry about the split room on this one. Uh, Cause I don't wanna spend too much time on this one. I already cleaned it out already. So I gotta double check this one over here, but it is working better. I had a, what did I have? Like 66 degrees in the vents. Now I have uh, around 58. So I think we're gonna be good on that one. I gotta just check some more temperatures. Try and get a split. Uh, I don't wanna hook up to them with gauges. I think they're, they're fine. The lines are sweating. There's no signs of uh, oil or leaks or anything. I'm just making sure that everything is good. I don't know if you can hear me. Uh, belt wise, I'm gonna check temperatures again, but I think we're okay. I just don't wanna get into call decks. Uh, they are just really dirty. 
Uh, we're gonna see a lot of that. I know coming up because summer just started, or summer weather. 